Hello friends, we were learning various operators that are present in Python. Earlier we have discussed about assignment operator and arithmetic operators. Now let's understand what are comparison operators in Python. Comparison operators are used to compare two values. So when we need to perform comparison operation between two values, we can use comparison operators. Comparison operators, they are also known as relational operators. So you can refer comparison operators as relational operators. They are exactly the same. Comparison operators, they are binary operators. As we discussed, comparison operators require two operands in order to perform comparison operations. Hence comparison operators, they are binary operators. Remember, when we use comparison operators to perform comparison operation, the result will either be true or false. So we can tell that when we use comparison operator, the result will be a boolean value. A boolean value can either be true or it can be false. These are various comparison operators that we have in Python. Now you might have studied about comparison operators in your mathematics. They are exactly same. Now remember, as we discussed, all these comparison operators, they are binary operators. Hence they require two operands in order to perform comparison operation. The result of comparison operator is always a boolean value. So it can either be true or false. Now let's understand each of these comparison operators in Python. First we have less than comparison operator. Less than comparison operator will take two values. If the value present on the left hand side is lesser than the value present on the right hand side, then the less than comparison operator will give true. Otherwise it will give false. Next we have greater than comparison operator. Greater than comparison operator will take two values. If the value present on left hand side is greater than the value present on the right hand side, then greater than comparison operator will return true. Otherwise it will return false. Next we have less than or equal to comparison operator. Now less than or equal to comparison operator will take two values. If the value present on left hand side is lesser than or equal to the value present on the right hand side, then it will return true. Otherwise it will return false. Next we have greater than or equal to. Now greater than or equal to will also take two values. If the value present on left hand side is greater than or equal to the value present on the right hand side. In that case the greater than or equal to comparison operator will give true or else it will give false. Next we have equal to comparison operator. Equal to comparison operator will take two values. If the value present on left hand side is equal to the value present on the right hand side, in that case it will return true. If the value present on left hand side is not equal to the value present on right hand side, in that case it will return false. Notice we are using to equal to sign in order to represent equal to comparison operator. Next we have not equal to comparison operator. Not equal to comparison operator will take two values. If the value present on the left hand side is not equal to the value present on right hand side, in that case it will return true. If the value present on the left hand side is equal to the value present on right hand side, in that case it will return false. So not equal to comparison operator is completely opposite of equal to comparison operator. Now in order to represent this not equal to comparison operator, we use this exclamation sign and equal to sign. So these are various comparison operators that we have in Python. Less than, greater than, less than or equal to, greater than or equal to, equal to and finally not equal to. Remember all these comparison operators are binary operators and the result will always be a boolean value. So it can either be true or false. 